Welcome back to Breakfast Television. Well, Petapalooza is this weekend at Eau Claire. It's the largest pet festival on the West Coast. So here to tell us all about it is Jordan Illingworth and a bunch of bulldogs right behind us. Can you see it? How amazing is this? Okay, so first of all, you have to tell us, what is Petapalooza? So Petapalooza is the largest event of its kind. It is a pet festival for basically anything that you're looking for in the pet industry. If you've got a dog, a cat, even a ferret, uh, there is something for you at that show. Really? Mm -hmm. So what kind of pets are we talking about? You mentioned a few, but does it go all the way to like birds and reptiles and all that kind of stuff too? It does. We have definitely expanded, so we've got some of those particular vendors. I mean, it is definitely canine dominated, Sure. Uh, but we do try to um, bring something for every type of pet. For every type of mm -hmm. pet. Okay, so what can people expect when they come down this weekend? We've got so much going on this <laughs> year. Uh, so, of course, one of our biggest events is the dock diving competition that we've got. Okay. So it's a 100-foot pool and dock. Uh, if you're around, you're more than welcome to come and Terrific. jump Drake, Drake, which is a <laughs> giant German shepherd. And uh, and he just takes off? And he'll jump for anybody. He jumps for me, too, which I'm, yeah. I'm not a dock diving uh expert but he he's uh, so much fun to uh to watch to, i bet to jump too wow um and then we, of course we have the running of the bulls okay. which is french and english bulldog races <laughs> so the winner will compete for 500 dollars in prizes and a massive wrestling belt wow okay uh, as well as uh the puppy stampede oh that would be cute it's adorable so like how many puppies are we talking about i think we had about 50 puppies last really? year really so the race is open to anybody with uh, a dog under six months so oh, wow. it's not breed specific, <laughs> and so it's a nice way that uh, anybody can come down and enjoy that one. Um, and that one's even funnier than the Bulldogs because they don't really, they just start playing they in the middle of the, race, <laughs> of the race lanes. <laughs> Uh, and then we have the wiener dog races, oh, which wow. is always really fun. That's always fun. Mm -hmm. So apart from some of the races, you said there's vendors that are out there too, that are so you can find out some new sort of information about pet supplies and things like that? Yeah, absolutely. We've got over uh, 150 vendors, wow. 25 of which are rescues and nonprofit organizations that oh, we've great. donated booths to. So uh, you can also come down if you're looking to get your new best friend. Oh, sure. Um, so that's really great. We have some amazing sponsors, uh, Joyce from Sleeprovers with me here. Here today nice uh, and you know with without sponsors like that you know the event wouldn't be Just possible and, yeah you know and our incredible exhibitors we of do course. have some some of the top top exhibitors yeah thing. terrific is it a family friendly event absolutely yeah we really encourage everybody to come down including the dog including the dog and uh, it is pet friendly we just encourage uh, responsible pet ownership so making right. sure your dog is physically fit of course to attend the show of course. Uh, and that they're good in crowds because okay yes it would be important. busy right it yeah. is going to be a pretty busy weekend. how many people come down for things like this we had about 18,000 people last wow. year over the weekend so it does get really uh, pretty packed but it's a great space so Claire's amazing sure. there's um, some cool down stations that we've got all over the property, lots Wonderful. of water stations, uh, lots of food options, so you can come and enjoy a whole day. Well, that sounds terrific. Mm -hmm. Okay, so of course the big attraction, or one of the big attractions <laughs> is the running of the bulls. We're going to give you a little taste here on breakfast television this morning, so why don't you and I shuffle off here, and we'll see the running of the bulls. Shall I do a little countdown? Okay, guys, line them up. Why don't you guys, so who have we got here? Who's the first bulldog? Bueller. Bueller. Who's the next one? Jude. Jude. And Tony with the backpack. How much fun is Tony with the backpack? Okay, guys, are you ready? Three, two, one, go! <laughs> Tony with the win! There they go! It was that backpack. <laughs> this is amazing. These dogs are terrific. Look, oh, look, they just want to hang out on the carpet. <laughs> oh, my God, he's a scene stealer. Oh, look at him! It's the backpack. He knows he's fly. <laughs> this is amazing. Now, if you want to see more of this action this weekend, of course, the Petapalooza is happening at Eau Claire Market. It's in the parking lot there, the Saturday and Sunday from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. <laughs> Thank you so much for being here, Thank Jordan. Thank you for having us. And we're going to stay with these dogs right to break. We'll be right back on BT. <laughs>